Hi, my name is Jake Kleiner. I'm the technical support manager here at WeBoost. Today I'm going to talk to you about the bars on your phone. So what do the bars on your phone really mean? Well, honestly, the bars really don't mean much as one phone could show five bars and another phone could show two bars and you're getting the same signal strength. So for a more accurate way of reading your signal, we recommend putting your phone into a test mode. Let me show you how to do it. To put your iPhone into test mode, go to the phone button and dial star 3001 pound 12345 pound star and press the call button. You'll see it comes up and says field test and there's some options below, but don't worry about those. What you'll do, scroll down your notification bar and in the upper left hand corner of your phone where your bars used to be, you'll see the negative number right there. That's your signal strength. To make that number permanently show up, hold the power button for roughly five seconds and then hold the home button for another five seconds and that negative number should always appear in the top left corner of your phone, as you can see here. For any Android phone, go into your apps and go into the settings. Once in settings, go to general and scroll all the way down until you see about device. Click on about device, then go to status, and then find your signal strength right here. There's your signal reading. When you're in test mode, you'll notice there's a negative number. That's your signal strength. Don't worry, it's always going to be a negative number. The closer you get to zero, the better your signal will be. For instance, negative 100 or worse is not a good signal, possibly not even any signal at all. Negative 50 or better would be as if you were standing next to a cell tower, so that's an excellent signal. Thank you for watching today. I hope this was helpful to you. Please subscribe to our channel as we'll be coming out with videos every week. Thanks, have a wonderful day. Oh,